Morning guys, welcome back to another episode of Aussie Funny in Philippines. What a glorious day! Look at this! Still no rain for a couple of days. Bloody hell, how good is that? I tell you, I am happy. But this tank ran out yesterday. I turn all the tanks off now and I turn them on separately instead of leaving them on so the flow comes down on them all. But this tank ran out yesterday. So I had to, oh, a big yawn. I had to turn on the other tanks, but um, that's still okay. Right, so what's happening today? Well, I've got to get all these Christmas decoration lights down. I've got to do that today because I haven't had, haven't had time to do that because I've been catching up on all the mowing. And uh, because when it, when it rains, you can't just bugger all. So what I'm going to do today, this morning, is get all these lights down, put in the box and put away for next Chrissy. But I must say, it was a bloody good event, guys. And thanks to everyone who supported us on helping the kids out. And seriously, the kids get nothing, mate. Absolute nothing. Nothing, nothing, nothing. Even on their birthdays, it'll be like, if they can get a cake for their birthday, that is like, wow. But they have to be very special to, to get a cake. You know, like, I remember one year, Louis, Louis was having a big argument over some bloody thing. Louis next door here, I always niece. I said to Chick, what the fuck's all that about? She goes, oh, he's upset because he didn't get a cake. I said, well, did he get any presents? She said, no. <laughs> all he wanted was a cake. So um, they went out and got him a cake. Right, well, let's go and see how well my babies are going. So it's just after six now. What about five past six? The sun is up beautifully. So a guy come and brought... What was his name, that bloody goat? Francis, Sir Francis Drake. So a guy contacted Chick yesterday, and he came over at um, just before four, and I uh, had a look at all the goats, and he said, yeah, I'll take Francis. He said, he's a cutie, and I said, bloody hell, if I wanted to keep him. So, and he's looking at our chickens, and Chick said, yeah, they're um, Rhode Island Reds. Yeah, and he says, I'd like to um, start breeding them myself. What's she doing out? He said, I'd like to start breeding them myself. So Chick says, look, I've got Big Red Original here. You can take him. So that's why he's no longer here, guys. He's no longer here. So we gave him we gave him Big Red Original for free. And uh, he was quite happy. He's, he's walking down he's walking down the pathway he parked out the front. And uh, he's walking down the pathway saying, I got a free chicken. I got a free chicken. I got a free chicken. So he was very, very happy. Because he was a big bass. He's like, look at the size of these hooks. And the big big fellow was bigger than him. So why is his goats out? So Francis has left the farm, guys. And uh, Chick's advertising. Chick... <laughs> Polly said he wants these two have a fight. The ch two chickens have a fight. Polly! Thank you. Leave them fighting. This is fucking weird. This is weird. Yeah, big boy. See, he's, he's recovered well. I don't, still think he can't see out of that left eye, but he recovered. What's going on down there? Have to go down and have a look. Guys, what are you doing out? They've got out and they can't get back in because the door's shut. So Chick's given them all their bottles last night. She gives them bottles about 10 o'clock. I think about 10 o'clock, 9.30, 10 o'clock. How weird. How weird is that? Right, well, we did have a little bit of fun with um, Francis while he was here. So that was quite good. What's wrong with you, bitch? This is the mother of the, um, the baby turkey and the two chickens. Hey Peggy! Look how big big they are. Where are they? That's not them. Surely. I think that is them. She must have realised that um I think maybe the little chickens have realised that they they belong to um Bing Maria's babies. These are Bing Maria's babies, these ones. And these ones here are hers as well that I put under the turkey to hatch out. So Bing Maria was a good a good lay, as they say. There's a turkey down in here somewhere. I seen it last night come down yesterday afternoon at feed time. It come down through the side there. 
And I went, aha. So I'm going to have to get down to see where, because I can't burn that off if she's she's got a little nest there. They are getting big, those little buggers, aren't they? There's Polly over the back having a shit. Taking a shit, mate. You all right? Okay. Right, well, go and check Duck Duck's food out. <coughs> go and check Duck Duck's food out, and then I'll get all the others fed. And um, honestly, it's going to be an easy day today. So I'm going to try, I want, if I can find in the freezer my chicken thighs and chicken breast, I'm going to make up some more chicken ham. Because Earl Wilcox came over the other day. I just didn't eat anything from last night, look. So Earl Wilcox came over the other day. We was at the gate with Bob. And uh, he said, Kev, you got any ham? He says, I want some ham. We can't get any. And I said, um, all I've got, inshallah, is, is my chicken ham and uh, some other stuff. So I gave him, I gave him that, gave him some, um, was it some chicken ham and... What's the other, some other fucking meats, I can't remember. We had so much of it in the packets. Salami, that's right, salami. I had so much salami, sliced salamis in the packet from SNR. So um, I gave to him. So, and Earl looks like he may, may be moving on again. He's got um, two options to go to. So it'll be quite interesting. Quite interesting. It's good when you're young, you can still travel the world like I did and work. It's quite good. All right. Let's go and get these buggers fed and then I'll get some more comments done before breakfast and after brekkie I'll get Oi Oi to help me with the lights because Chick's going to be busy. Chick's going to be busy. Hey girlfriend. Hi. Hi mate. Hi. Bacon. Babe. Getting big babe. Babe you're getting big. Hey getting big. All right let's stop talking and let's get feeding. All right guys. Have a great day wherever you are. It's pizza night tonight. Pizza night tonight, so it's going to be yummy pizza. And I got some. I brought some chicken breast that I can barbecue up because I like my Christopher Beecham pizza, which is a roast chicken breast on barbecue sauce pizza. I fucking love that. Christopher Beecham, thank you very much for showing us that. All right. What's that? Oh, wormy. That's all right. Wormies don't worry me. We had some, we had some snaky poos like this in the um, feed room one day. I moved the, I moved the box over, and I looked at them. And I thought, oh, worm. There was two of them, but they had the big diamond head on them. They had a big diamond head, and of course they moved in the snake pattern. And it's like, fuck me, what's them baby snakes doing in here? And I go, this is a worm because it's got no, no head. Look, it's got no head. All right. Please watch, share, subscribe, or bye. I'll catch you all later on. Bye-bye.